something uh, real easy so uh, I think I'm gonna call this one the balloon 101s so my thought of balloon 101 is if you're going to balloon school or uh, you're just first learning out there are about you know five or ten um, basic designs that basically everybody knows and, and they know how to do so um, so my thought is why don't we put together a couple of those <clears throat> of those designs and maybe we'll do five of them at a time so um, first, we have our basic balloon dog here, cute, adorable, cute and adorable, a classic, of course, right? So we have our basic balloon dog. Next, we have our balloon sword, our just two twist balloon sword, the very ba most basic of, of swords. Okay, put that one aside. Of course, what would balloon 101s be without adorable looking flowers? right so a flower um, and then we have a heart <laughs> uh, because they're cute and adorable of course so a balloon heart is number four and then lastly um, we have a balloon bumblebee so I don't know if you can see that guy but it's a cute little one balloon bubble I think the goal for me making these is what am I doing? Um, is it working? Uh, and is it working consistently where I'm, you know, knocking out quick designs? And I think, um, you know, for, for me, for John, I, I constantly want to be growing. I want to be getting faster and de developing my skills um, to be in a place where I'm not just kind of stagnant or I'm, I'm happy with where I am. I, I, I want to be challenging myself. And, and that means, you know, for me, I, I can make really great, you know, cool designs, um, in my opinion, but I, you know, the basic balloon swords and the flowers, I mean, you always come back to those. I'm always making those. So if I can make, you know, two or three or four uh, more designs, um, a party because I've practiced or because I've challenged myself to, to do different things, then then that's what it's about. So it's not so much about racing John; it's about racing yourself. You know, timing your first, um, timing yourself the first time through, um, at home, uh, and maybe you got a really excellent time, uh, and then challenging yourself. And isn't that how we grow? We challenge ourselves and and see if we can move faster or move, um, you know, be more efficient with our motions. So that's it. Uh, it's not you know I'm not making this video to offend anyone or or anything but maybe presenting an idea, what you're doing is great and wonderful and we want to be entertaining and all that. Could we be faster? Could it, you know, um, could we do these designs so many times and so quickly that, you know, in essence, they do become second nature to us and then all we're doing there is just having a conversation and making these because of, you know, muscle memory and, and we've just, we've learned how to do these things so great. So that's the purpose, um, hopefully, that you guys get from this. So, right? Um, we'll do them the same way that we did last time. You have your timer uh, ready and uh, no balloons on your table, just your balloon bag or um, whatever. Um, do them in whatever colors that you would like. If you want to make a blue flower or a green flower, it, it doesn't really matter. Right, get ready on my timer here. <clears throat> Mine kind of fell asleep, so. <laughs> mm. All right, you guys ready? On your mark. Get set. Wait, wait, before we. Okay. You ready? <laughs> Sorry, I forgot what I was going to make. Ready? A dog. On your mark, get set, go. An orange dog, why not? <laughs> Alright, well. <laughs> Good enough. Alright. Next one is a sword. Probably not the best of color choices. <laughs> Here we go. I think this one is a flower. So with the flower, let's do at least um, five petals. I'm trying to get this.
next one is going to be a heart. So that's a little trick that I learned from Michael Floyd, I believe, teaching this design is that you don't have to, you don't have to tie it. That you don't have to tie the, the nozzle of the heart because we're we're just going to tie it to the bottom of the bottle. We'll add three stripes here to the bumblebee and a smiley face. And that's time. All right. Woo. Not too bad. So let's see what we have here. Okay. So we did the pink, the pink heart. Okay. That's what that looks like. Perfectly acceptable. All right. And then we have our bumblebee here. Cute little bumblebee. You can see his face there. Okay. Looks good. Uh, this flower, not so much. <laughs> it just looks like a, like a blob. I was trying to do something tricky, but it didn't work out for me, you see? So I'm going to try something different next time. I was trying to squeeze the air from the bottom. So you can see the bottom here is all misshaped because I was trying to squeeze the air to get the top so I didn't have this little kind of nipple thing at the at the end. Oh well, you know, making adjustments. Um, and then we have our balloon sword, although I do not recommend choosing this color um, for obvious reasons, but perfectly good. Uh, and then we have our dog. <clears throat> so my problem is I put too much air. I was still worried about um, the amount about what design I was going to need to make, so I added too much air, but it resembles a dog that's perfectly passable in my opinion. All right, so we reset our time. We're going to, uh, how about our next go? I think the first time was 2.04, so um, let's try it again. Whenever you guys are ready, okay, press pause. Okay, welcome back from pressing pause. Here we go. We're going to start the time in, ready, three, two, one, go. Let's do a gray dog this time. Again, too much air. <laughs> That's all right. Oh, much better. There we go. There's a dog. Okay, now let's see. Let's do a flower this time. One, two, three, four. So this time, as opposed to trying to just brush through it, trying to have the design look a little bit better. There's a flower. Okay, let's do a heart next. Again, you don't need a tie, you can just tie it to the tail. <clears throat> Ah, there we go now. Sword. Whoops. Big curve. All right. Sword and then a B. Oh. And the B will draw the face. Down. Time. So 155 that time. 155.39. So as you can see, 155.39. <clears throat> Much better. I think my designs look better that time too. 
Let's take a look. All right, so we have our gray sword. Looks good. Perfectly acceptable. Okay, then we have our bumblebee, of course. Looking good. We have our hearts. Okay. And we have our flower. I like my flower leaves to be a little bit bigger, so I think I was trying to... I know I was going faster this time, but maybe next time I'll try to <clears throat> just make... I, I really like the way that the big flower, uh, the big leaves on the flower looks. I think it looks cuter as opposed to having a, a really long stem here. Um, and then our... What was it? Oh, the puppy. That's right. The gray puppy. Let's fix his head here. That's a good puppy. Cute little guy. That works. Okay. All right. That was number two, 155. I think we reduced our time almost by, what, like 10 seconds. Uh, and our designs look better. So we're going to reset our time. Okay. I'm going to press pause so you guys can get ready. Okay, pause. Welcome back. Thank you for pressing pause. Hopefully you're ready for round three. I know I am. Um, <clears throat> so here we go. You ready? On your mark, get set, go. We'll take our feet this time. Add a little bit more air. There we go, puppy. Oh, let's do. gone all sorts out of order. We'll do we'll we'll do the uh, we'll do the flower next. Just one. <laughs> Couldn't get any air in there. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Now we need to make this a Fifty-seven. All right. So one fifty-seven forty-two. I think that may or may not have been my first. I think I one fifty-five the second time. Oh well. So I'm right there in about that two-minute mark. Uh, in my opinion, uh, five balloons in less than two minutes. That's <laughs> I, I. I don't. I mean, I'm not complaining. Uh, I think that's that's a pretty quick speed. I'm sweating already. I only made what 15 balloons, and look at me. Woo. Uh, okay, so hopefully you guys like this video, uh, the balloon 101s. Uh, keep practicing. Hopefully you're getting faster. Again, this isn't about beating me. It's about beating you. All right, we'll see you guys later. Take care. Bye.